In February of 2021, I went to South Africa, Johannesburg, to do a shoot for a campaign I was doing with Valentino. So my first night there, um, the guy who was showing me around, he takes me to this fabulous restaurant, fabulous, fabulous restaurant. And then as after we're like done eating and stuff, he's like, come, let me show you something. I'm like, cool. He takes me to a speakeasy underground he takes me downstairs to speakeasy underground for those who, of you who don't know what a speakeasy is so a speakeasy is basically like an underground club like a secret fun club and that was basically my time there until like we were waiting for the campaign to start so the campaign was extended because the communication was between milan la and south africa so there was a lot of broken communication so we had to extend it because people didn't really understand each other so during my whole time that's all i did like we went to this like cool art galleries um we were seeing all this like um going to see this artist like do graffiti like day parties speak easy it was just like it was so cool it was just cool beautiful people wearing cool nice clothes doing cool beautiful things it was like an indie movie the whole thing was like an indie movie so when um my trip was extended i needed to go to brazzaville anyway so i went to brazzaville and then because i was doing a photo shoot with one of my friends i go to brazzaville and then i fly back to south africa Africa a few days later and the first day I'm back we go to this street bar it was called Blondie's it was so cool we went to Blondie's we have like drinks and stuff and then after Blondie's we wanted to go to bowling and arcade so each of us like enters a car um for those who are driving for those who are not driving so I got in the car with one of our friends um she was driving a convertible BMW and I remember us just like my hair in the wind my fenty sunglasses it was just it was so cool it was just the music playing Thames was blasting it was amazing and as I was there I just thought to myself and I was like I'm not going back home I'm not going back home and that night I told my assistant to cancel my flight back home I called my mom and dad and I told them hey um I'm gonna stay in South Africa. And that is literally what I did. And I learned how to skate. I started an affair with a skater boy. Um, yeah. <laughs> we just, I just stayed there doing fun, cool shit with fun, cool people, fun, cool, beautiful people. It was literally an episode of Euphoria the whole time. And then, yeah, after that, I had to leave eventually. But that was my time in South Africa. And that is actually how I moved away from home.